Hello everyone, it's time to listen to another song today, and I know this is kind of a one that's a little bit hyped up. It's called Think About Things by, um, you know, an artist or group here that I'm not going to pronounce because I can't. Uh, it's from Iceland, um, so that's exciting. Uh, and this is a, uh, you know, a live performance because I, I was considering going for a music video versus live performance. I ended up going for the live performance because I saw that the music video was over four minutes long. And I figured, let's just go for the, for the live performance. Uh, it was even recommended to me, so uh, here we are. Let's get right into it. I'm gonna stop yabbering because I do that way too much anyway. Mm-hmm. Chords are nice. Arpeggio is nice. Okay. I like the bass sound of it. It's a nice melody. Nice energy in it. The kick is constant, you know, and there's, the bass comes in focus along with the vocal. They kind of harmonize with each other. It's nice. Great rhythm. Great rhythm in that melody. I like the backing vocals along with him as well. Okay, he's... Practiced his dance moves here. <laughs> it's kind of fun. It's a nice melody. It's really nice. Okay, the horns really put in focus here. I like the guitar as well. There's a nice rhythm in everything here. You know, it just puts you in a good mood, doesn't it? His voice is like really, really good. It's so, you know, just casual, but so confident still. There's a nice combination of sounds going on here. Alright, the second chorus is, you know, it still has the same energy, same impact. <laughs> okay, there's a little bit of variation here, that's nice. Nice harmonies! Okay, solid syncopes. I could have wished for a little bit more impact in the choruses, I think. <laughs> oh, nice ending pose as well. The crowd seems to dig that one. All right, that was uh, that was really pleasant and really enjoyable. I th I thought it was really fun. Uh, that's that's the main thing. Um, you know. Uh, obviously, since since this wasn't a studio cut, I'm not gonna be able to judge the production quality of it to its perfection. But it, I mean, it sounds polished enough. Uh, I think the instrumentation is really in the focus here. Uh, what they've done and how they've arranged the song, because it's really fun how they've put everything together. Um, there's a lot of different fun ideas combined, and they play around a little bit with the breaks and with the with the different drum patterns and. You know, you, you sometimes you focus on the bass, then you focus on the guitar. The vocals are in focus at times, and then you have the horn. You know, like the whole chorus is very horn-based. Uh, so it, there's a nice combination of everything, really, in, in this song, instrumentation-wise. Um, and I think the, you know, the melodies are great, especially there. Before the first chorus, you have this really... 
snappy rhythm, I think, in both the vocal delivery along with, with the backing instrumental in that segment. So that was really enjoyable. Um, and, uh, you know, I just think there were many solid ideas. It's, it's well put together. That's, that's the main uh, thing I have to say about it. And then, you know, it's performed really well um, with, you know, charm, with charisma and a great enjoyment factor into it. Um, I think that th that my main concern really would only be, you know, with the choruses. They're, they are, you know, the same throughout, um, even though there are different harmonizations and such and uh, different things uh, that that might, like small details that change around. I f do feel like the impact of the first chorus, you know, you still have the same impact in the second and the third chorus, and then that can kind of become a little bit underwhelming because maybe you expect it to uh, to elevate or to progress further at some point. Um, but that's, you know, <laughs> I mean, it's a stylistic choice at the same time, and and it's only something that I expected to happen, and then it didn't happen, so I just reacted to that. Um, but that's really my only main uh, main thought going out of this one. It was an enjoyable experience, really, all altogether. So uh, I enjoyed it, and I think a lot of you out there do as well, because otherwise it wouldn't be hyped up so much. So do tell me what you think of this song in the comments, and we can talk it out a little bit. I'm interested to hear all of your opinions, either if you absolutely love it and you tell me why, or if you maybe uh, despise it and then you tell me why as well. Or if you're in the middle, you tell me why as well. Uh, because I want to hear all kinds of different opinions so we can, we can, I can really take it in and, and uh, consider every aspect of it. Uh, other than that, I will see you in the next one. So uh, until then, take care of yourselves and bye-bye. Uh,